think one reason why this hasn't taken off amongst environmentalists, why they're not seeing this as a climate solution, is because some environmentalists have a distrust of technology. And I want to address this. So there's technology and then there's meta-technology, shall we say. So there's technology and then there's the technology we need to manage the technology. So let's say we went back, we're gonna, we're gonna go back in, in our technological development to something that some people might consider a primitive, fire. We're just gonna have fire. Well, you think that's quite simple. We, we all have fire and so now we have a light source, heat source, uh, a way of cooking, cool. But if you have fire and people just start setting fires everywhere and everything's on fire, that's not really helpful. You can't have pyromaniacs take over. And so you need systems in place to control the fire. So then you need a fireplace. You might need a chimney. A big bonfire might be too much. So you need, oh, you just need a little speck of fire. Well, now you need to invite a, invent a candle. So now you're worried, you're still worried that things are gonna be set on fire that you don't want them. So now you need a bucket brigade or you need a fire, you need a fire hydrants, you need a, a fire fighters, fire trucks. So it's not just fire, it's all the other technology that you need to make fire work for you. And so when it comes to the physical internet, my thinking is, well, we have the internet, the internet is taking off, one could say, like wildfire. But we need all the other meta technologies to get the best out of this technology and prevent the worst from happening. So the equivalent of candles, fire hydrants, stuff like that. That's what I want to be working on. That's what the next internet project is about.